Brazil. And today is our choir cantata. And so today we're also celebrating uh, the choir and the music director. So a big thank you to Reed um, and all the choir members for how they share their gifts of music and share and proclaiming the gospel. Our service today has been adapted for the cantata, so everything you need to have today, though, is in your bulletin. And then after worship, we head over to Fellowship Hall because there's an abundance of food for you and for fellowship and conversation. Thank you to everyone who brought things and to the right family who has set everything up. Next week is Share the Love Lunch Packing. We're going to be packing lunches on Christmas Eve at 10 o'clock in the morning. So if you are around and want to help pack lunches, it shouldn't take any more than an hour. We're going to make sandwiches, pack lunches, and then go to the hall. They will be delivered uh, to people on Christmas morning after worship. Next Sunday, we have, um, or, I'm sorry, Christmas Eve will be on Saturday. We have worship at 7 p.m. Which is like family service, and then that's followed by special music at 9.30 and then at 10 o'clock uh, in a family service as well. So hope to see many of you there. And then Christmas Sunday will be at 10 o'clock normal time. We have lessons in the And all of the information can be found in the morning. Now let's prepare our hearts to worship as we listen to it. Thank you. 
The lady will weep like a deer, and the tongue of the sea will sing for joy. God's ransom people will return and come to Zion and sing. They will obtain joy and gladness, and sorrow and sign will be put away. With joy, we will say, Give thanks to the Lord, praise God's holy name.
things. Through your goodness, you have blessed us with these gifts, ourselves, our time, and our possession. Use us and what we have gathered to claim the world with your love through the one who gave himself for us, Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Open your hearts. We to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give our thanks and praise. It is indeed right our duty and our joy that we should at all times and in all places give thanks and praise to you, Almighty and merciful God, through our Savior Jesus Christ. And so, with all the choirs of angels of the church on earth and the hosts of heaven, we praise your name and join their unending hymn. <laughs>
and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ strengthen you and keep you in his grace. Amen. Let us pray. O oh God, in this holy communion, you have welcomed us into your presence, nourished us with words of mercy, and fed us at your table. Amid the cares of this life, strengthen us to love you with all our heart, serve our neighbors with a willing spirit, and honor the earth with that name. Through Christ our Lord. So the last section of our cantata includes congregation participation. If you will turn to the final two pages of your bulletin, there's some music there. Um, the choir knows this pretty well, so all familiar carols, but I will cue you when it is your turn to sing with the choir. These are all familiar singers, so you can join with us in the song.
to hear this clapping and uh, the amens and the resounding um, acclamation that God is indeed present here and has spoken through the music and the stories the gospel has indeed been proclaimed. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. And now we can continue over at Fellowship Hall where we can celebrate the work of the choir and the way in which they proclaim the gospel this morning. Go and please share God's love. Thanks be to God. <laughs> 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 Thank <laughs> you. 